So today guys I'm gonna be reviewing the the icon the World Cup icon Garincha I uh, packed out of the recent 89 plus icon you might have seen it in a review in a short we did. Was these five star four star medium low pretty that's pretty good for an attacker. Positions are a bit annoying, can only play right wing and right mid. Obviously this year we have a lot of right wingers. Obviously I think he's shooting a bit too low for my liking for this point of year. Obviously, I did a review, I did a re reveal, and it had 95 dribbling, and I thought it was Pele. Obviously, his dribbling is basically unmatched. His traits are unbelievable. Now, his pace is, he's not as fast as I, as I thought he would be. Obviously, his stamina is good, but his pe his dribbling is the main, the main aspect of it, which we'll see in some of the clips today. Um, I'm playing him in a 4-4-2 right striker alongside Drogba who I'm loving at the moment which obviously you guys are too as well by the views of that video so let's get into the gameplay So, we would have just we would have just seen the gameplay that that, that, I've, that I've played. I played I played him in foot champs. At the I'll, I'll tell you guys, at the start for the first three, two or three games or so, I had the heaviest gameplay I've ever played ever, and I thought and I honestly hated him. I I, I hated him. Like I hate I hated a lot of players on my team, but I thought because it was the first time I was using him, I was thinking, oh, he's gonna be incredible. But then but then when I but then when after after them games, my 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 gameplay became a lot better, smoother, and I, I'm sure you can see that through the through the through the clips here because I could actually dribble with him. His dribbling actually came to fruition, and not just in the, which was a big comparison from the first couple of games. But that was that was a really really bad gameplay, so I wouldn't take that take that too seriously because anyone can have bad get bad gameplay and make anyone like it can make an, it can make Neymar feel horrible in the game. So. My review on him, I'd say he's a very good player. I think his shooting is too low. I think he he has a you would have seen that he had a lot of one on ones which I would have just expected him. I just shot across goal. And I'd expect it to just go in. I've been trying out the new low drivens. Maybe that's the reason I tried because a couple of them were just like they look like low. They look like p rollers. But I was just trying to get the new uh, low driven technique on on lock. But obviously he missed a couple of them. He so from that. So we'll try upgrade that with the with the chem style. We'll discuss that in a minute. So, but the main thing I would say is, obviously at this point in the year, what is it? 
17th. 17th of February. I think a lot of people will have... So many people have that jersey in our SPC. And on a, I think he's the best... I've said it so many times. I think he's the best SPC they've released this year. And if you didn't do him, then you missed out big time. Because I think he was... Eight, I think he was 800k from my recollection. He was he's so good, and in my opinion, look, let's let's have a let's search him up. I think his his shooting is just even on his mid card. Bear in mind this is Jairzinho's like moments meant to be moments card. His shooting is 89. He's got not, a bit better finishing. His he's so much better than um. I think I than this Garincha card in my opinion. Yes, granted, look, he's 1.9 million, but I can I can imagine a lot of people have. Have the, have the night have the ninety one like I do, which I dropped him for this exact. I want to play. I dropped them both, but and and another issue is if a lot of you have that Jairzinho, it's very difficult to get them both in the same team because they can both only play right mid and right wing. So they would have to probably get at a four three four three, which is a bit annoying if you want to play four back, which I've I've had I've struggled with. So I'm having to only play either of one. So if I was going to go either one, easily Jairzinho. But let's, don't get me wrong, this Garincha. His dribbling is impeccable, but Jairzinho just has the upper body strength of he has 68 physical. What would I do to improve this Garincha, though, however? Finisher. It just upgrades that finish. Look, look at that finishing. Perfects the finishing. Maxes out the finishing. Puts his position in to perfection as well. 99 finishing, obviously. Shot power, for, which shot power could have been an, could have been an issue as well, maybe. I, there was a couple of shots that I thought, hmm. Like the low drivens, I thought, hmm. Bit, bit more power there. Probably goes into the probably nestles into the bottom corner and then the dribbling. People could say the 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 balance is a bit low. That like starts he starts off at eighty eight balance, which for a person of five foot seven, I'd probably expect him to be a bit have a bit have a bit more balance there. But so just up, with the finisher, it just upgrades it even more. Obviously, it maxes out the agility. The dribbling gets maxed out as well. The composure and the reactions, I think, his are perfect anyway. They don't really need the upgrading. Obviously, his passing, he had a couple of assists. You would have seen he had a chip ball over to Drogba, who should have scored. But we're reviewing Garincha today, so that was a good little. It was a good little pass from him. Obviously, he's not as fast as you'd think he would be, being five foot seven. But again, with his height, it just makes him easier to easier makes him easier to to dribble with. So would would I recommend getting this card? If you pack him, definitely use him. If but if if I was comparing him with Jairzinho, Jairzinho is better. And especially if you did the SBC, I think the SBC was about eight hundred k, which a lot of people have done. I think I play him. I seem to play him about ten times a weekend out of the twenty games. So definitely, definitely try him if you if you packed him like me. But if you really if you if you're really deciding who's better, him or Jairzinho, Jairzinho is better. But if you don't have Jairzinho, this Garincha is probably one of the best. Is, is arguably the top three right right wingers in the league in the in the game even, like Bar Messi obviously, but yeah, thanks for watching guys. Leave a like and subscribe.